Game Dev Journey. Hey everyone, it's Rob here from Game Dev Journey. Welcome to episode 9 of my series promoting the Godot game engine and where you can learn how to use it. Godot version 4 is just around the corner, so it is the perfect time to start your game dev journey with Godot. I found some hungry new Godot tutorial makers keen to challenge those at the top. They're here to help you level up your game dev skills, so come and learn with me. Like the video if you enjoy it, and subscribe if you want to support small creators like me. Lucy is an indie developer creating amazing game dev tutorials. Lucy makes content that you simply will not find anywhere else. Want to know how to make a better 2D explosion? How to make curved terrain? Or how to use the scroll wheel to zoom in? Well, Lucy has a tutorial video for you on all of that and much, much more. Lately, Lucy has taken to live streaming her development content, so if you want the freshest Godot material out there, and your burning questions answered live on air, then you had better tune in to Lucy's channel now. Brano is quite new at making Godot game dev stuff, and I have to say that he's off to a great start. You can find a range of Godot tutorials which are very beginner friendly and will encourage you to pursue your passion for game dev without getting frustrated. I particularly enjoyed one of Brano's newer videos in which he details how to transition from being a Godot beginner to a Godot novice. He explains what each of those terms actually means and shows the steps to make progress detailing which tutorials to follow too. This is really good stuff and I suggest you view it for yourself. Busy Weasel Games is the channel of Lucas Sane. He is a game developer and an RPG fan. Of course, he's a fan of the Godot game engine as well, and his channel has great Godot tutorials, as well as devlogs of the games which he's currently working on. If you've ever wanted to know how to make your own 3D FPS game, and you want it explained in a detailed but beginner-friendly way, then this is the channel for you, as Lucas's latest video does just that. I suggest that you check it out, as you will not be disappointed. Eli is an aspiring indie dev and a digital artist. He creates assets for you to use in your games. He also makes great Godot tutorials, presented in an entertaining way, and reduced to the shortest possible time. If you want to learn how to make Flappy Bird, or a 2D platformer, or a top-down shooter all in under 15 minutes, then you're in the right place, because Eli will teach you all of that and more. Seriously, this is a great channel for Godot educational content. Do yourself a favor and visit now. Bastian Oligi makes many tutorials and educational videos about the Godot game engine, and specifically using virtual reality in Godot. I'm not aware of any other channels with a focus on creating VR content with Godot, so this is your go-to spot if you're developing for VR platforms. It's amazing to see just how capable Godot is at creating and handling VR content and how easy Godot makes it to create content for VR, with the help of people like Bastian of course. Honestly, it's just fun to watch the videos of these worlds being created. There's a lot to learn too, so come and see for yourself and you'll gain a new perspective on Godot and perhaps even the world. That's all for this week. Once again, thanks for joining me and I hope to see you all again next time.